decision phases in supply chain management. In supply chain management, we distinguish between three types of decisions or decision phases. Strategy and design are the long-term decisions. They are about how to structure the supply chain over the next several years or maybe even longer. Decisions involve uh, choosing locations, capacities, modes of transportation, uh, maybe the information systems that will be used internally and to communicate with other uh, companies in the supply chain. These decisions are long-term and uh, hard to reverse, um, very expensive, and so they have to. They are really difficult because they have to take into account a lot of uncertainty about the future. Planning decisions are usually a set of policies that govern short-term operations over the next year or a quarter. This uh, the decision phase, right, sets policies. For example, we can set an inventory policy, how to replenish inventory, at what time, in what quantity, from which supplier, or we can decide about policies of uh, which factory will deliver to which uh, region uh, and which products and so on. And the third phase is operational decisions. Operational decisions are much shorter time horizon like daily or weekly. And the goal is usually to implement the operating procedure pro policies that were set in the earlier stage as effectively and efficiently as possible. I hope you can see that uh, the uncertainty is the highest in the strategy and design phase. This is where we have to plan for the next uh, five or ten years and we take expensive decisions and we, if one makes a mistake, the impact of this mistake is, is uh, very uh, expensive. On the other extreme, the operational decisions, if, if you make a wrong decision in, in this stage, there is, of course, an impact, immediate cost or, or lost revenue. However, these decisions are, are not as uh, expensive if, if, or hard to reverse that uh, we cannot deal with it. So, so these decisions have the least uh, uncertainty to deal with. Still, all decision phases are important for the supply chain success.